Namaste and welcome to Gan. In today's topic we will understand about India to launch global alliance for big cats and what is IBAN. So, let's begin. Government of India has proposed to launch a mega global alliance under its leadership to protect big cats and assured support over 5 years with guaranteed funding of 100 million US dollars, over 800 crore rupees. Last month, the government reached out to potential member nations with its proposal. According to a proposed timeline, the alliance is expected to be launched next month in a suitable office complex in India. According to the Environment Ministry, the alliance was inspired by the arrival of cheetahs last year from Namibia. Since the arrival of cheetahs, India is the only country in the world to have tigers, lions, leopards, snow leopards and cheetahs in the wild. India have all the big cats except the pumas and jaguars today. So it is only befitting that India takes the lead to bring together all big cat range countries under an unlike umbrella. Membership to the alliance will be open to 97 range countries which contain the natural habitat of these big cats as well as other interested nations, international organizations, etc. What is International Big Cat Alliance? IBCA is a proposed mega-global alliance that will work towards the protection and conservation of the seven major big cats tiger, lion, leopard, snow leopard, puma, jaguar, and cheetah. IBCA's major activities will include advocacy, partnership, knowledge e-portal, capacity building, ecotourism, partnerships between expert groups and finance tapping. Composition of IBCA The IBCA's governance structure will comprise General Assembly consisting of all member countries. A council of at least 7, but not more than 15 member countries elected by the General Assembly for a term of 5 years and a secretariat. Upon the recommendation of the council, the General Assembly will appoint the IBCA Secretary General for a specific term. Funding of IBCA For the first 5 years, IBCA will be supported by India's total grant assistance of $100 million. After this, the alliance is expected to sustain itself through membership fees and contributions from bilateral and multilateral institutions and the private sector. Expectation from IBCA Big cat conservation in India has a long history of success. India has set an example when it comes to the long-term restoration and rehabilitation of a rapidly receding animal species. It was able to achieve that through a global consensus and an association with many different organizations. The plans for the current alliance also build on this practice and aspires to further enhance the already strong big cat population in the country. With the increasing number of leopard sightings in cities and constant loss of habitats for many animals, aided with cases of encroachments in many tiger reserves, the move is a welcome one and its correct implementation just might mitigate the problem in big cat conservation we currently face. Does India has all seven big cats? India is home to five of these big cats, tiger, lion, leopard, snow leopard and cheetah. Royal Bengal Tiger As per the latest tiger census conducted in 2018 to 2019, tiger population in India has increased to 2967. India now accounts for about 70% of the world's tiger population. Asiatic Lion Gir National Park in Gujarat is the last abode for the surviving population of the Asiatic lions in the world. Since the late 1960s population of Asiatic lions has increased from less than 200 to 674, census 2020. Leopard It is estimated that 12,000 to 14,000 leopards occur in India and the population is the most genetically diverse outbred out of all the subspecies in Asia. Snow leopard is native to the mountain ranges of Central and South Asia. In India, their geographical range encompasses a large part of the western Himalayas including the territories of Jammu and Kashmir, Ladakh, Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand and Sikkim and Arunachal Pradesh in the eastern Himalayas. In 2021, there are about 7,500 snow leopards left in the world, out of which 500 are in India. Cheetah had become extinct in India since 1952. In September 2022, Cheetahs have been reintroduced in the wild in India as eight cheetahs were imported from Namibia. They were released into the Kuno National Park in Madhya Pradesh in November 2022. This brings to the end of today's discussion. I hope I have been able to make you understand the topic. Thank you for your time. Stay safe and stay happy.